Right, as promised, next video. Um, this one is a little bit of an unboxing on a delivery we've just taken. Uh, big thanks to Simon Ling. Animals arrive nice and toasty. Can't beat the service. Cold blooded movements, the only ones I'd recommend or use. Um, and an even bigger thanks um, to Andy and Kerry Stevenson for sending these boys down. They're playing a big role in this year's plans. Uh, yeah, so look forward to seeing what they can do. Um, always nice when you have hatchlings return and see what they're like as, you know, growing on adults. Um, but yeah, so hope you enjoy. Let's have a look. Right, so Cold Blooded Movements has just dropped off two snakes. This is the first of those two. Um, they were taped up as well, but um, I took the tape off just to save a little bit of time on the video. Because Andy, it, it was strong old tape. Alright, now let's see what we have in here. Been looking forward to these two coming for all week. Always nice to have babies returning. Well, you little man. Look at this beauty. As you can see, in absolute perfect condition. They arrive lovely and toasty as well. But this little boy, he's a bamboo pastave. So bamboo pastel Mojave. Um, he's possibly got spider in him. Um, here's a picture of when he hatched, it will pop up. Um, but yeah, as you can see, he's an absolute little beauty. And credit to Andy because he's in perfect, perfect condition. He's showing his little face for you. He's a little beaut. But yeah, so he's he's going to feature very well in our plans for the coming year. Beautiful little snake. Right, so now we have number two. Again, remove the tape. Um, so let's see what's in this one. This is the one I'm very excited about, if I'm honest. Um, got a little, nice plan for this little boy. Let's get him out. I've been told him he's a bit feisty. He's always been a bit of a feisty little bugger, even from hatchling which I'll show a picture of him when he was younger, coming up now. Look at now, this boy. Here we go. Look at that little beauty. This boy here. Let's get him out a little bit so you can see him. Again, perfect condition. Andy and Kerry really do well looking after their royals um, top keepers this boy though is something special as you probably as you can probably see let's get him closer as you can see he's very dark still as GHI black pastels get older they brown out quite a bit but this little boy still looking so dark and I think since he's a GHI black pestle dinker, I believe that his mum that produces these beautiful dark babies has, you know, an influence on how his colour has stayed. This is the mum coming up now. She's my big dinker girl. Over the years I've had some really nice snakes hatch out from this girl. Um, very dark. But like I say, this boy features very highly got a couple of plans for him but mainly if he goes back with mum we could possibly as long as luck is with us see what's going on um, I'm hoping there's something going on like I say she produces dark babies and this boy's a testament to that because he's still so dark but yeah so fingers crossed we get to find out 
thanks again, Andy and Keza. And see what these babies can do. Right. So that's it. Um, I hope you've enjoyed seeing what's coming home. I'm really excited to get these two boys breeding. Joe Chai needs a little bit of growing up, but he'll be fine. Um, looking forward to him going back to mum. See if we can find out what's going on, if anything's going on. It's always exciting when you could possibly prove out a project. So, fingers crossed. I mean, there's other plans for that Joe Chai boy. I won't quite go into them at the moment, but future video, we'll see. But um, thanks for watching. I hope you've all enjoyed it. Don't forget, join us up on Facebook, Instagram, um, subscribe to the YouTube. Uh, yeah, hit the bell icon and hope you enjoy them. Thanks a lot.